Hey YouTube, thank you for tuning in to Kiki Life of Tea and welcome to 2021 Taste of Friday. Yes, we have finally made it to 2021 and we're done with 2020. And I'm pretty sure, like myself and the rest of the world, we are happy and relieved, okay, to be, be, to be done with that year. <laughs> um, but yes, let's get ready for our wealth, advancement, growth, whatever you want to call it. I'm ready for it, and I'm sure you guys are ready for it too. Um, but today we're also celebrating me reaching my 1,000 subscribers. I'm so happy guys and I really want to thank everyone who got me here everyone who has hustled to get me here especially the past couple days I kept sharing on my Facebook page for anybody who hasn't subscribed to subscribe to my channel to help me out to get to the 1,000 subscribers and they did and I really appreciate it um, I want to thank everybody who has liked my videos comment on my videos of course subscribe to my channel um, anybody who has shared my videos with friends and family and even shared it on their pages I really appreciate it. I wouldn't be here without each and every one of you. And I just see myself, the goal for me in the end is to go even past YouTube. Um, as you guys know, I'm a black influencer and I just want to advance. I want to work with companies. I want to create more partnerships in 2021 and get more money and create relationships and network, okay? Um, but two people in particular, I want to thank specifically who has motivated me and pushed me to create my own YouTube channel. And that would be my best friend, Sunshine Sha. That is her YouTube channel. And I will put her YouTube channel link in the description below. Um, she really motivated me to create my own, um, with my own vision. And she's very helpful. She's never selfish. You know, some people would be selfish. Like, I don't want, I got secrets to this. I don't want to share it. But I really appreciate her sharing with me what she knows um never hesitating when i have questions for her and i really really appreciate it bff i really do and the second person i want to thank is my friend shin she motivated me to create my channel based on relaxed hair videos she was like i don't see too many um relaxed hair videos with people with long healthy hair i believe the world needs to see it and hear it so that was just icing on the cake for me. So I went ahead and finally did it last year on January 1st. I uploaded my very first video. I'll actually put a card above of my very first video. Um, the background and the quality wasn't that great. But you will see once you get to my second video, you will see I did a better job, okay? I did much better. <laughs> um, but, um, I'm happy where I'm at. I'm happy where I'm at. I'm steady learning, trying to make better quality videos for you guys, more entertaining videos to keep your attention longer. Because as you know, the longer you watch my videos, it's better for me. Once I have ads in my videos, it really helps. So do keep that in mind in the future. Um, if this is your first time tuning in to Taste of Frye, be sure to hit the subscribe button, like this video, and comment and let me know what you think about this Taste of Frye. And of course, once again, Happy New Year. But let's get started. So I want to do something different for the new year and something different than what I've usually been doing. So today we're going to be trying out Drake's Organic Spice Spiked Ice. It's a variety pack, three mango rum punch, three vodka lemonade, three watermelon martini, and three classic mojitos. And what really brought me on to this drink, it has 15% of alcohol. I just knew it wasn't gonna have that much alcohol, but it does. So I'm pretty happy about that. Cause you guys know I don't like no wheat drink. I just don't, I just don't. I'm sorry, but I don't. <laughs> Let's see, let's see. I'm gonna taste the watermelon and the classic mojito. Let's try it out. So this is a classic mojito. You'll see it here. And let's try it out. A little slushy. I don't know if you can see it, but it is a little slushy. Let me get the red. A 
lock melon looks weird. Look at that. Watermelon don't look really that good to me. I'm sorry. But it don't. Look at that. I was expecting this to be red. But it's slushy. So we're gonna try the watermelon and the classic mojito. But keep in mind, there are two other flavors, which is the vodka lemonade and the mango rum punch. I really don't like mango alcohol. But these have 40 calories each. So, here's the label on the back. Hope you guys can see that. So let's just open it up. Taste it. And it is 100 milliliters in size. It's a freeze and eat the pouch. And again, once I said, 15% of alcohol. And it says organic and certified vegan. So all my vegan lovers, all my vegan lovers, you can drink this. So that's good to know. Okay, let's try it out. You can taste like, I feel like it has, it's, it's sour because of the lime. Definitely can taste the lime a lot in this. If you don't like lime, you probably won't like this one. But I believe if you eat a lot of these, you will be drunk. Because it is, it has 15% alcohol. That's like more than some wine that I drink. Okay, so that's cool. It's sour though, it's too sour. I don't like it. I don't think I like it. I said I'm gonna try the strawberry, but it's really not giving me strawberry vibes of the color at all. But let's try it out. This is a watermelon martini. And same information. This one has 40 calories as well. That's nasty too, y'all. I'm sorry, but it is. And then again, you see the vegan label on here. This is nasty. It's nasty. I'm sorry, but it's nasty. <laughs> I've never said that on Taste of Friday. But it's nasty. Let's try the vodka and lemonade. Like these flavors don't taste right. Um, I'm glad I have another drink. <laughs> Come on, my Let's go ahead with the vodka and lemonade. Let's see how it tastes. This one nasty too. I'm sorry, but it is. It's nasty. We done. I don't try three of the four. So we done. <laughs> We're done. Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. We're done. So that's nasty. Check that off the list. <laughs> so now let's try the on the rocks. Oh, and I forgot to mention to you guys. This at the liquor store was actually high. It had a nerve to be expensive. It was $24.99. It was on sale, thankfully, at the liquor store for $19.99. For $19.99, and it definitely is not worth it. That's just my honest opinion. <laughs> but this on the rocks premium cocktails, the Cosmopolitan from F and Vodka. Now this was almost $30. FYI. And this is only a 375 milliliter bottle. bottle is not even big at all but let's crack it open I love the bottle though it's so cute definitely a ladies drink in my opinion okay guys let's 
try it out. Now, when I first started drinking, I ain't gonna say when, but <laughs> when I first started drinking, I was a vodka drinker. Now, I'm really starting to move towards cognac, dark liquor. And, of course, you guys know I love wine. But when I'm trying to have a really good time, I like some cognac. And no mixed fruity drinks. No, because it makes me sick. So I have matured in my alcohol choices. <laughs> but let's try this. Now, this tastes like... It has lemonade in here. It's a made with premium vodka, triple sec, elderberry abstract. Now, if you got, if you've been living through the pandemic, you should already know elderberry. Elderberry is good to boost your immune system. So, win for the win, okay. And it says has natural flavors, colored with vegetable juice. It tastes like it has lemon in here to me. So I'm trying to see. It say blends of vodka, flavors of cranberry, triple sec, lemon zest, and lime. You definitely can taste the lime just a little bit, but you can more so taste the lemon. So, but it's not bad. I like it. And the alcohol, good percentage, 20%. Win for the win. Okay, guys. So in the comments below, let me know if you guys ever tasted spike popsicles. Now I have seen other popsicles. Um, this is the first time I ever tried it. This has vodka in it, and it has Drake's organic vodka to be specific, of course, Drake, right? And um, I've seen some with wine. And what brought me to wanted to get this one? It had actual hard alcohol in it, so. You can try for yourself. I probably won't buy this again. I probably will be giving this away to a friend because I didn't like it. But, of course, you guys already know, this is the win from F and Vodka, the Cosmopolitan. So I like, I like it guys. So guys, once again, thank you for tuning in to my 2021 first taste of Friday. Thank you guys for supporting me, Kiki Life of Tea. And I look forward to making more content for you guys. And I hope you will continue to support me. Once again, don't forget to subscribe. Hit that bell so you're notified next time I upload a new video. As you guys know, I upload every week. However, the day does change. So you don't want to miss it. So hit that button. Hit that bell. And be sure to hit the like button if you love Taste of Fridays and me putting you on to some good joints. Okay? Alright? And I'll see you guys next week. Bye! See you guys!